The kitchen gadget set for the non-traditional holiday meal. This is a seafood tool set that's designed for oysters, shrimp, or crab. My favorite is the crab cutter. You know, cutting crab can be such a pain. This will go through anything. This will flawlessly cut through crab shells without leaving any mess and getting you the most meat. Shop this and all my favorite holiday kitchen gadgets at hsn.com. And who better to get us ready for the holidays than Wolfgang Puck. We have an entire hour with him. You're gonna see our today's special that's gonna help you bake bread and make bread and bake bread and break bread with all your friends and family over the holidays. But first we wanna cook up some pastries and some pies. A brand new design from Chef that's really going to make it so easy for you to make individual pies, whether they're sweet, whether they're savory. You also are gonna get your pastry cutter. So everything about this simple, easy, $29.95 your choice of colors we have it in the red we have it in the black and uh, everything you need to look at these beautiful pies that you're able to make chef this is one of your best sellers in the past but you've improved the design and made it even deeper than ever before so you're really able to do the sweet and the savory pies these are beautiful exactly yeah because you want to have pies where you eat the filling and not the dough you right. know when this Pies are so flat, when a lot of them you can buy them probably in the freezer or somewhere, you're eating dough and no filling. So what I like about our machine is that it's deep, but it's also totally non-stick and very even heating. So it always gonna make you the perfect pie. So this is really so easy. And you can start out making it uh, with any kind of dough, like pie dough or whatever it is, and look at that, how easy it comes out. Here it is. Yeah, just pop it right out. Mm. Yeah, pop it right out, and here is my cherry pie. All right, pop it right out. Now, you also can put an aluminum foil underneath, so that way it's even easier to pop it out. And then, let's look into it. Oh, look at that. Delicious. Our chicken pot pie here. And then we have a cherry pie here. Now, cherry pie, what I would do is maybe oh. put a little powder sugar on top and a little whipped cream. But okay, you're right. two pies. So look at all that filling so in there. So <laughs> easy. Look at all the cherry yeah. pie. That's the best part, right? I know. Put a little whipped cream next to it, maybe, and you're done. Oh, beautiful. So it's that simple. And now I'm going to show you how easy it is, really. The good thing is you actually don't have to do anything to it. You can actually start cold. It's even easier. So mine is a little hot. Is this one hot, too? What do you have in yours? Ah, okay, good. Uh -huh. Is that the right size? It looks a little small. So this is the oh, okay, good. No wonder. See? <laughs> I thought something is not right. And the piece we're giving okay, you shows so you, you exactly you get, the right size, right? Yeah, you get exactly the right size. You pull it in here, and it's even easier when it's cold. And then you get the filling here. You want beef? Okay. If you had some leftover steaks, I put some barbecue sauce, some carrots and everything, and I'm gonna fill it up. Okay. And then put the top on. Sorry, remember? Okay. All right, and you can see the way it is made here. It's gonna squeeze it together so you don't have to do anything. So if you wanna make two, one chicken pot pie, one beef, whatever you like, you decide. So just put that in here. At home, you can start out cold with the machine or if you make a lot of them, you have it warm. Just be careful when it's hot. And then we add the chicken to it. You could do chicken, you can do beef, you could do dinner and dessert. Yeah. You could do all of it at the same time. Yeah, exactly. My kids love it. You can make your chocolate cake in there, you know, your lava cake in there. So it's really easy. And then you just close it up. Okay, just like that. And then 
do that, and that's it. That's it. How simple is that? No temperature control, no no anything. I mean, no, that doesn't get easier. It will make it perfect each time. Every time. And it cooks at the top and the bottom at the same time, right? The whole thing cooks at yeah, the same totally. time. Yeah, totally. It cooks the whole thing all at the same time. That's what is so nice with that. And totally even, so so simple, so easy. Okay, we all have... Right, we have another one? And we have you this have in red? something in there? No, waiting for you. Do you want to do the apple? Apple sounds Apple. great. We have it in red, we have it in black. 1,500 of each to go around. Four flex payments, $7.49. Truly, couldn't be easier. Again, this is gonna show you the, the bottom part to cut, and this is gonna show you the top part, so you will never make a mistake. Chef, this is totally goof proof. Anybody can do this. All right, I have some apples. These are even store-bought apples. We add raisins to it, cinnamon, sugar. You can use fresh apples at home, whatever you like. And look at that. Apple pie, now it's really the season of the apple, so it's the right time for your apple pie. Okay, one. And again, we're gonna put the smaller part on top and you get the little cutter. Show us the cutter over here. Because of the time limit we have here, you can see the circle here. It's a big circle, that's for the bottom. On this side is the small circle, it's for the uh, top. So that way there is no guessing at all. You got it all just the way it is. So any kind of fruit mice, you can make them now just like a professional. And they all come out beautiful. Serve them with ice cream or with whipped cream, and you are done. A little cherry one. You okay, can do, my here we have our cherry pie. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Okay, this is it. So now we put the small part on top. Oh, yeah, there's a few little things so we know which one is which, maybe. Okay. So you can use pie dough, it's like perfect. Mm -hmm. Store pot, we use store pot pie dough. Yeah. So, so simple and easy. And look at that, look how fast it cooks. It oh. starts already getting brown, see that here? Beautiful. I love how it crimps the edges. I mean, just like a, a really yeah. very expensive pie. Totally, yeah. yeah. So in five minutes, my pies are ready. So it takes less than 10 minutes to make all that stuff. So simple, so easy, so fast. Now we, we only have four machines, uh, two machines here where we can make four pies. So I baked a few in advance already. Okay, let's see what we have in here. Apple pie, look at that. All we need what? is like little ice cream or we have whipped cream with it. Huh? But look and, how deep ooh, dish my that favorite. is. I mean, that's truly a deep dish apple pie that you are yeah. looking at right there. And, and perfect for an individual serving. Gosh, that's gorgeous. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's even enough for two for dessert, mm -hmm. unless you want to really splurge and love sweets like I do. <laughs> so I love sweets more than anything. I much rather prefer not to eat the main course to save myself for dessert. I look at that. that. Some leftover yeah. beef here. Right. Mm. You could do a little shepherd's so pie in the, there. All kinds I, of fun I things. I know, except a shepherd, a shepherd's pie, you can put mashed potatoes, polenta, anything underneath, and you can use it for breakfast if you want to. All you have to do is put some ground meat and some scrambled eggs on top and bake it in a pie, and you have a perfect, perfect dish for breakfast. So this is really a great little machine and a lot of fun to work with, huh, Marianne? Mm -hmm. I love that it crimps and seals, right? Because you don't have to be too neat. Yeah. You don't need egg wash. You just put it, your crust in. It's pie dough for the bottom, puff pastry for the top. And then it's kind of whatever you want to put inside from homemade to store-bought, and it all turns out great. And if you see the edge like this after it's crimped, if that yeah. bothers you, you can just kind of break that part away. Yeah. But see, isn't that nice? It looks so professional. I that know. is something that's so simple. And it's only three minutes to preheat, so uh, it's... Yeah. Quick and, and I easy. love when your boys were little that you started with the machine not plugged yeah. in so they wouldn't burn their fingers. And then once the pie was assembled, then plug it in. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah when I worked with my children, you know, I, it's, uh, they don't pay attention that it's hot. So I said, let's start it cold. 
and just put the dough in, the filling in and everything, and then I plugged it in, and they were totally happy, and the bites came out totally delicious. So for them, it was amazing. The deep dish that. pies, seven dollars forty nine cents. They are amazing. I actually did a party one time and lined up just different different types of, of pie filling. Let all the kids make them themselves because it's that easy. And look at the yeah. affordability, twenty nine ninety five. Red, black available at the moment. This is going very quickly though. If you'd like it, grab it. Let's go back out to Chef though and show us some more ideas. All right, all right. So you can see all the different fillings and everything. And you saw me actually doing. This is live TV. Look at that. Mine is almost done. Now, I like that the dough is really crispy, so I will cook it a little bit more. But it takes very little time, and you get a perfect pie. So, so simple, so easy. You can make them in advance if you want to. And then put them on the cookie sheet. Give me a cookie sheet or any sheet pan or whatever we have. Chef, I had a question. Can you use the phyllo yeah. dough with that? You can use phyllo dough. You can put in a tortilla if you want to right. and uh, make a Mexican dish out of it. Oh, also, yum. if you have more, let's say you have the whole family coming and you only have one machine, make a few in advance and then put them on our sheet pan here and we put it in an oven at 250, and when everybody is here, we can serve them. So it's so simple and fast. If you only have two for you and somebody, then you just heat it up in here again, even if you're making an advance. But I think it is so simple, so easy to do it to order. I think but I if it. you say, okay, I'm going, I'm going out tonight, I'm going somewhere, and then when I come home, I want to have supper, well, then you make it in advance, you come home and just pop it back in there or leave it in here and plug it back in and you're done. So maybe a little salad with it or if you just have dessert, make a tea or a coffee or a special drink with it and you are done. You know what, you've inspired I me. I love it. I want to do it with some, with some taco filling in it and use those flour tortillas on the top. Ooh, that sounds so good. Fabulous. And uh, speaking of fabulous, you have not seen our today's special yet. Stick around, coming up just a few minutes away. Two pounds, 14 functions. It is a bread maker that does so much more than just make bread. It makes jams, jellies, it'll make yogurt, but it will make the most amazing bread. And for the first time ever, a fruit and nut candy dispenser. So it will mix everything in throughout the entire dough. All you do is add whatever ingredients you'd like, under $100, five flex payments. You do not want to miss out on that. It is coming up in just a few minutes. But we have another very clever idea from Chef Wolfgang Puck, who always brings us great innovations. Because what you're looking at in front of me is going to be something that completely changes your pressure cooker. When it comes to your pressure cooker, we love our pressure cookers. If you have an eight quart pressure cooker, what you do is you add this to the lid and now it turns your pressure cooker into a complete air frying system so you can cook healthier and cook faster. We're gonna include the basket, we're gonna include the rack for you, you get everything you need, and most importantly, you get this. All you do, like I said, is switch out the lid on the pressure cooker that you have. If you don't own one, we have one available for you, eight quart, $59.93, four flex payments, red, white, black available. Chef, how does this work? So I, I start with the pressure cooker. Yeah, so, so this fits on any kind of pressure cooker, not just mine. You decide on whichever one you have here, okay? You put the temperature on here, it's hard for me to see it, and for you too. Did we plug it in? Not yet? No electricity yet? Okay. Let's see. Okay. Okay, now we are okay. Start. Temperature. 500, okay, we are good. See that? You actually can look in there and see exactly what happened. So just be sure there is a handle here. The handle has to be all the way down. So that way you can start it, okay? Then we can turn it on. You can, and you can see when the light is on, that's when it's working. So this lid, fits on any pressure cooker. So if you don't want to buy an air fryer, but you have already your pressure cooker, 
that fits on the pressure cooker, but not only on mine, on anyone. So on any pressure cooker. So that makes it just so easy. How we doing here? All right. What are you making? Where are you, Marianne? What are you frying over there? Looks like we've got it's, some it's French fries in it. vegetables. Okay. Okay, so you, you can roast in it, you, and you get a little basket with it, so it's really simple and easy. And it has a timer on it, so if you want to make fries, if you want to make a, a roast in there, a roasted chicken in there, if you want to fry some chicken fingers, you don't need another machine. You can use right just the cover here. So, and that's easy then to put away somewhere. See that? It's getting crispy already. Because how much time do we have? Huh? 60 minutes. Okay, then we can leave it a little bit more. Okay, stop. There's the stop thing. Okay, perfect. So this is really a great way to add a little gadget, something you're gonna use all the time to your uh, kitchen. Because everybody out there has a pressure cooker, or you can use the other one. What do you call it, the one? The air fryer lid? No, the, the pressure cooker. Oh, the, the one that's so famous? Yeah. The instant that has yeah. the pot? Oh, the yeah. So yeah, any pot, Instapot, pressure mm -hmm. cooker. Mine, obviously, my pressure cooker, we sold hundreds of thousands at mm -hmm. HSN alone. Oh, so absolutely. you get that, you make it into an air fryer now. And it's so simple, so easy. So you don't need an extra machine. You just do it right in here. Yeah, so I like that because we can do so many different things with it. Right, and it's so simple, it's so easy, yeah. and I don't have to buy, air fryers can be very big, very bulky, you have to buy certain amount of, uh, of uh, quantity in terms of five quart, whatever. Take your eight yeah. quart pressure cooker, whatever pressure cooker you have, it doesn't matter, matter the brand, add this to the top of it, you have an air fryer. So, Chef, now I'm cooking. I'm cooking healthier, I'm cooking faster, I'm cooking with that rapid air, so I don't have to add all the fat and oil anymore. We do have a cookbook from Marion. If you would like to get some inspiration, we do have that available. But everything's yeah, no, right here. Totally. It's easy, right? Yeah. And I love Alice Kit with cooking with this one. When you've made the pressure cooker foods and you love it because it's fast, it's easy, you know that chicken's cooked all the way through, but sometimes it's so wet and stewy and then you're just craving that texture. I know Wolfgang is all about texture. And so to be able to take that same pot of food, add this lid in place of the pressure cooker lid and turn it into something that's got melted ground cheese or something crunchy like a coating is a miracle and it makes it so simple with less space that it's taking up. Yeah. That's why your reviews are so great and why you love it so much. And it's really a great thing that you made it for us because we have so many pressure cookers, but we crave that texture and that change from the stewy part. Yeah, and, norm and normally in a pressure cooker, you cannot roast. You can give your food color. You cannot do anything here with that. You want to say, okay, I like his chicken soup too, but you know, once in a while, it's great to have a roasted chicken. So you can make your roasted chicken in the pressure oven because now you have the cover with the big fan in here. So that's perfect. Or you say, I want to make a few French fries, or I want to roast a little pork tenderloin, or anything you really like. <coughs> okay, now let's look in here. I'm going to take one off. I have to reveal something. I'm getting nervous here. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. So nice. you can put it right down. And look at that. Here we have our chicken. See that? Mm -hmm. And it doesn't touch your thing because we also have the little insert here. See that? So all the grease, the fat, the liquid, whatever it goes, goes to the bottom. And you have a clean roasted chicken right here. You've cooked Look healthy, you've drained all the fat, and so yeah. you're losing the calories. But you get the Christmas the crispness that you crave. Exactly. That we don't Look get at with. a beautiful brown color. Mm -hmm. We want to get we get the close up here. Look at that. Yes. See that? Beautiful. Yeah. Crispy. <laughs> this is gonna transform your pressure cooker. It keeps it, you will still have your eight quart pressure cooker, but just add this lid to it. Okay. And now you have an air fryer that's gonna yeah, be little, an eight quart capacity on top of that. 
Yeah, so it's so simple and mm -hmm. so easy. So tomorrow, if you want to use that as a pressure cooker, you use the regular pressure cooker lid because every pressure cooker comes already with the lid anyway. So you make your chicken soup. You do anything you want. But if you use the air fryer, it makes life so much easier to put different things. We don't going to eat the same preparation all the time. So let's see here. The fries are getting there. It could be a little bit more, but we have time. Here, only that much. Now look at that here. See that? It's already nice and crispy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but they're healthy. You haven't just dumped them yeah. into a big vat of oil or anything. And you get the crispy exactly. crunch. And don't forget the money. Oil costs a lot of money. So instead of frying it, where it costs you twice as much, you fry them with air. It's healthier for you. It's crispier, it tastes more pure, it's not like oil. Oil, sometimes you use it the first time, it's really good, but by the time you use it the fourth time, it has a flavor. So with this, there's no flavor contamination. Okay, you do. What do you have, Marianne? This is that pork tenderloin with vegetables under it. So a whole meal that doesn't have to go under pressure because it cooks fairly quickly, but it's sitting on the trivet so the hot air from the fan is going all the way around it, making the vegetables get crispy, making the bacon on top of the pork tenderloin get all rendered and crispy, but still staying moist because it's cooking quickly. But see, this is how easy a meal can be with Wolfgang in your kitchen. That's one of the reasons I love using your appliances. It just makes it better in the kitchen, yeah. faster and easier, and a more pleasurable experience for sure. Everything's going to And cook. you know, we are all concerned about our health these days, so we don't want any additional fat, any things which we don't really need. So now you can have it the way you like it and have it perfectly roasted without any extra calories, without the food sitting in a lot of oil or things like that. And, and if your grandchildren come over, you get them some chicken fingers out of the freezer if you want to. You don't even have to get fresh ones. And then just fry it for them. And they will say, oh, my God, thank you, Mom. Thank you, Grandma. Thank you, Auntie, for making me the chicken fingers. They'll love the pizza. It does, too. It does the best pizza. All of this, $59.93. Again, it works with uh, your huh? pressure cooker. If you need a pressure cooker, we do have the Wolfgang Puck 8-quart pressure cooker. Just add the lid. That's all it does. It turns it into an air fryer. So red, black, and white available for you. We have four flex payments under $15. Gets this home. And, uh, Chef, we just wanted to give everybody a little peek at something that you have this day only because we're doing your prep series. So we have your entire bakeware set for you right here. Four pieces of your silicone. It's completely collapsible bakeware. You get your round, you get your square, you also get your um, your loaf pan as well as your muffin pan. So all of these, only $1,600 to go around. We have a special price this day only, $23.95 for flex payments and two color choices. So it's available in the black. We also have it in the red. Look at how this collapses down. Isn't that so smart? So it's so easy to be able to store that and to pop things out too. So that's available as well. Stay in the ordering process for, for that. But you have to stick around because you're about to see something you have never seen before. And believe me, when it comes to baking bread and breaking bread, we've got the perfect way to do it up next. Okay, so I'm not gonna be shy about it. I like to eat. I'm a real foodie. And I'm telling you, we've got some tasty foods, and they've all been curated just for you. Grab a seat and join us. Good eating with me today at 5 p.m. What really separates a house from a home? A home should provide comfort, coziness, and convenience. Join me on Monday nights where I'll be giving you great ideas for your home, your kitchen, and your life. We use goat milk because we had it, and that's how our company started. But what we learned over the years is how beneficial goat milk is, not only for the skin, but for your body. Goat milk adds moisture to your skin. It's really the most amazing ingredient. People really do notice the hydration of their skin. The farm to skin difference only with Beekman 1802.
holidays are all about baking bread and breaking bread with your friends and family. We have the perfect way for you to be able to do it every day. Fresh baked, simple, easy, in a way only Wolfgang Puck can bring us. Here comes our today's special. And it is indeed a bread maker unlike any other. To call it a bread maker is an understatement because this will make jams, it will make jellies, it will make yogurt, but it will also make the perfect bagel, the, the perfect brioche, the perfect baguette, and everything in between. But for the first time ever now, you not only have a very slim, compact design that will make one pound, 1.5, or two pound loaves of bread, you can decide if you want it light, medium, or dark. But in addition to that, you now have for the first time ever the ability to dispense nuts fruits even candies it will mix in with your dough evenly perfectly it does everything you add the ingredients it mixes it it lets the dough rest and then adds everything in and bakes it to perfection we have it available in the red we have it in the black if you want it in the black Final 700 now in the black. Stainless steel has been our best seller on the day. Very sleek design. Also in your turquoise as well as your mint. We're including for you six of your gift boxes as well because that's what we do. We bake for the holidays and then we give them as gifts. So we're gonna get you all started with six boxes. And in addition to that, you may wanna add this into your order. We do have the bread, um, some in inspiration from Marion Getz in the Bread Machine Cookbook. But again, jams, yogurts, you name it, you can find it right in here. Chef, never designed like this before. And when you look at being able to get this home for under $20, to be able to bake bread, yogurt, jams, you name it, right here. Yeah. I think it is the most amazing price, but the price wouldn't matter to me. The way it works, it's really incredible. Incredible, And you can make so many different breads, like basic bread, French bread, whole wheat bread, wheat bread, uh, gluten-free bread. You can make pound cakes. You can make even yogurt in there, or you can make your jam in there. You can see we made strawberry jam here we made yogurt here and we made pound cakes in there i mean you name it you are you can do whatever you think you go to your local base bakery and look at something and you know you can make it too you can make your doughs in there you can make custom doughs in there so this machine does everything for you whatever you will ever need i think if you're a baker if your family loves bread and if you spend a lot of time at home if you are two people or four people, whatever it is, it is worth to get a machine like that because there's no more guessing. The machine does everything for you. If you want to go to somebody's house, you bring them a pound cake like that. You get the boxes, look at that. You arrive and say, okay, I brought the syrup. Oh, I brought your cake for tomorrow morning for breakfast, a little cake in the afternoon or just a whole bread loaf here with whole wheat bread in here. Look at that. People are gonna say, wow. And if you know your friend is gluten-free, bring them a gluten-free bread and said, I made it for you especially because we really care about our health. So it is amazing. So this machine will help you in your kitchen every day, every other day. And you can program it. So if you love the smell of great bread, like a cinnamon raisin bread in the morning, what do you do? You can program it here because it has the custom programmer here. And then you can have bread at seven or eight in the morning, fresh out of the oven. Like if you would go to your local bakery. I mean, if my mother would have had that or my grandmother would have had them, she would have been in seventh heaven. She had to do everything by hand mm -hmm. and then watch how it rises, watch how it bakes, turn on the oven and everything. It was so much work. This makes it easy for everybody. Look here, I have a beautiful loaf of bread. You can even decide what color you want it. Uh, you want a dark color or a light or medium. I like my bread with a good color because I think it has more flavor. So that's an important part for me, but you decide what you like. So mm, I can smell the cinnamon in here. Oh, Look at that. Oh. Beautiful. The texture. Mm, it smells, it smells so good. And the, 
texture of that bread is just amazing. You know, in the old time, they had bread makers where the bread became really like a brick, really hard, really mm -hmm. dense. Not now. Look at that. Mm -hmm. yeah, I can fold it up. It wow. is so soft, so tender, just perfectly. So if you want to make now bread for a little sandwich in the afternoon, or you have friends over for tea or whatever it is, or just for you, you're a little hungry, use, I'll use cream cheese often or butter. Put a little bit of that on it, on the warm bread right out of the oven. You don't want to be able to resist it. And then with your homemade marmalade, you also get the recipe for the marmalade. So you buy your older strawberries or you use older fruits and just make them in there. And look what we have. All of a sudden, the most delicious breakfast or lunch or whatever it is. All right, do we get a little plate so I can put my bread on? Thank you so much. Okay. All right, I'm gonna continue. I don't gonna eat as much now, but I'm gonna continue and show you how I gonna make the bread. How easy it is. You don't have to go to Harvard or MIT or USC or anywhere <laughs> like that. You can do it being like me, who only went to school at the, until I was 14. Okay, look at that. So here is the insert. See that? So that goes right in here. You put it in and twist it over. Okay, perfect. And then you add always your liquid first. A cup of water, a little oil or butter. And then here we have our flour. We add the flour to it. So this you can buy from us already ready. So you don't have to worry about yeast. If your yeast is working or anything, everything is working. And then we're gonna look at the mode here. What is the mode? We have a basic bread. So they're all up here. Actually, you would close it, but I show you how it works. So basic, quick, French, ultra fast, whole wheat, cake, like pound cake. Then you make a dough. You make a sweet bread like a pound cake and so forth. You make jam. So you decide what you want. So mode one, we say basic bread. So we have to go back to number one. Okay, number one. Then the loaf, it's a two pound loaf or one, one and a half pound. It's a two pound loaf. The color, medium, dark, light. Okay, let's put it medium, okay? And then all you have to do is put on starch. And look at that, the machine starts to work. Now, obviously I show you, I keep it open so people can see what's going on. But at home, what would you do? You will close it up and you go on with your day. And you come back three, four hours later, you will have the perfectly baked bread. It's done, you don't have to worry, it doesn't gonna be cooked in the inside, or you know, often if you don't know how long it is in, you forget to set the timer and things like that. With this machine, it does everything for you. It kneads the dough, it proofs the dough, it bakes it. All you have to do is eat it. I mean, how much better can life be? Uh, doesn't get any better oh. than that. Under $20, yeah. you get this home. This is crazy. It does every, you, you know, Chef, you think of how many steps it took to make bread in the past, and a lot of times oh. it just didn't turn out well. It had a lot of air pockets in it. The perf perfect way, and it's so simple. Yeah. Just push the button and let, let the machine do the rest. And by the way, we do have, if you want the cookbook, we do have the, the inspiration from Marion available for you as well. So pick this up and get started with it. You can do everything, bagels, baguettes, you can do pizza dough, you can do any jams, yogurt. What would a yogurt machine cost you? You don't need any of that anymore. A slim, Porter, uh, a slim design that's gonna fit right on your countertop. Red, black, stainless, we have turquoise, we have the mint, your gift box is coming with it. But Chef, everything about this just couldn't, couldn't be easier or smarter. I love that the machine yeah. even knows how long it needs to rest. Yeah, totally. The machine does everything for you. You know, if you have, all you have to do is really put the ingredients in and then take the container out with the baked bread. And you don't have to boil it, the oven is too hot, the oven is not hot enough, whatever. 
This machine will make everything for you. You can see in here, look at that. See, it starts to need the dough already. Can we get the clothes in here? All right, in my little blue machine here, or turquoise machine, no, no possible? Okay, look at that. <laughs> it's fun to watch so it. <laughs> it stops it, it turns it. It stops it, it turns it. So that's gonna make a beautiful dough. Okay, I close it up and see. So here, I made the dough before and took it out. You can see that? This is a whole wheat dough. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a, what do you call that? A braid, exactly. See, I'm, I'm, I think I'm doing that for too long. I forget the name of a braid. <laughs> yeah, I should know because my sisters had braids when they grew up. <laughs> and now look at that. Uh -huh. Nuts or braids, braids is better, no? Okay, you squish it together at the end. Oh, this is a little a long one. Okay, get it over with. In the center. And then here. And then get the next one. Your, yeah, sister, so your sisters big. would be very proud of you. You're doing a good job with your braids. <laughs> I, I know, yeah. I, I, maybe I get, I get in the hairdresser business. <laughs> All right. Okay, let's put them up here. Okay, and continue. And that is the sheet pan we do have available. 17 by 11 comes with four silicone inserts in case you're interested. We'll give you the yeah, item number. And on look that. at that. You put a little mm -hmm. egg wash on here, some poppy seeds, sesame seeds, you like it. In Austria, we use a lot of poppy seeds for our baking. And then we let it proof. and then we bake it, so so simple. So you can do total custom baking. Now, you wanna make a pizza dough, for example, that's exactly what you do. You take out the dough, form the pizza balls, and then you make your pizza. And look, here we made one a little earlier already. We put a few chocolate chips on top, and that's what you have, a beautiful loaf of bread. Even that, if you bring it to somebody's house and you tell them you made it specially for them, they're gonna say, ah, you're kidding, you cannot do that. How are you gonna make the dough? How are you gonna bake it? But now you can with the machine. And all you have to do is just pick a number. I mean, that's all you do. It exactly. is pre-programmed. Okay. It's so simple. You do not have to get out your, your rolling pin or flour or anything else. You put the ingredients in, let the machine do everything. You just have, the hardest yeah. part I think, Chef, is deciding which one to do. Because there's exactly. so many, there's so many I, choices. That's why. Yeah, at the beginning you start out, okay, you make uh, the wheat bread, then you make the whole wheat bread, and then mm -hmm. all of a sudden you're gonna start to add grains to it, seeds to it, whatever you think, whatever you have, you can add to it. And then all of a sudden you're gonna say, you know what, let me try to make some yogurt. And then you're gonna taste the yogurt like you never had before. It tastes so rich, so delicious. Look at that. Here is Marianne with her yogurt. All right, now look, look at that. Look, it's so creamy. No, nothing added to it, just creamy, delicious yogurt. And I love for yogurt in the morning. My doctor actually told me it's very good for your stomach to put some yogurt in it, if, especially if you have high acidity. Mm. You put a little sugar and a little vanilla in it, it's really delicious. Put a few berries on top. All right, all right, a little, what do you call it? Granola on top, yeah. Okay, and now you have another breakfast. But you, nothing okay, tastes like fresh. Away. Nothing tastes like fresh, fresh baked bread in your home, fresh made yogurt, fresh made jams, jellies, you name it, baguettes, braids. You can do yeah. bagels with this. You can do all those kind of breads that you see in the bakery that you spend all that money for, but don't buy the bread in the store when you when you read the ingredients, because chef, you were talking earlier about how you can put a, a loaf of bread on your countertop and it can last for weeks now. There's just kind of something wrong with that. You know, it's not meant yeah, yeah, to totally, do that. totally. So because people add so many additives, so many preservatives to their bread, 
that they stay like that forever. They're like sponges. But you know, your stomach feels like a sponge there too. And then you don't know if you eat two slices, you said, oh my God, I feel so bloated. If you have really natural bread, you won't feel that way. You're gonna say, oh my God, you know what? I can eat two slices and I still feel like really good. So that's really an important part, I think, by having something done the way it should be done, the way it was done in the old time. And some bakers actually now are getting back to the original way. But you go to a certain special specialty bakery, you buy a loaf of their bread, it costs $15, $16, so it's really expensive too. So because they use good flour and no preservative. Mm -hmm. Listen, under $20 gets us home. Try it. We haven't extended our holiday returns till the end of January. You will start baking with this. You will never stop. The kids will love it. The grandkids will love it. You will love it. It will take you right back to the memories that you have. But this bread is goof proof. This, everything about baking with this, it's done for you. So there's no chance of screwing it up. No chance of, did I let it rust enough? Did I did over knead it? No, nothing. It's simple, easy, and the amount of different things you can do, 14 presets on this, Chef. So it couldn't be easier. Yeah. The colors, again, red, black. We have the stainless as our bestseller. Turquoise mint, gift boxes yeah. included. Baking season has arrived, but this isn't about a season. This is about a memory that, and a, a flavor and a taste you're gonna get every single day. Exactly. You're going to use this bread maker all the time because it's so simple, so easy. If you don't have my bread mixture, you buy any kind of flour you like. You buy a little yeast and put the water in, get Marianne's book, so that way you really can't screw up. And then you continue making the bread for the rest of your life. And you're going to say, Wolfgang, I never had bread like that in my life. This is really the way to go. Now, look. Here is the paddle in here with the bread. You get the little hook here and you take out the paddle. So that way you can cut the bread really easy. And it's up to you. You want to cut them in big slices, small slices. You can cut them in half. You can make your paninis. Do we have some sandwich meat here or something? All right. And here we're going to make a little mayonnaise, a little sausage or something and have a delicious panini made also with a little cheese if we have it. I think the consistency of the texture throughout the entire oh, loaf of bread. The texture is so amazing. When you cut it once, you're already gonna say, oh my God, I just wanna eat it the way it is. <laughs> right. You know, it is so delicious. And you know, you okay. see the crust yeah, on the outside. The crust on the outside, yeah. but it's Beautiful. so soft on the inside. Totally. So. I'm gonna show you how I make my sandwiches. They are bringing me a little bit of the pastrami or whatever they have, or maybe just some tomatoes and some cheese. So I add a little mayonnaise in the middle on the slices here. And sometimes, or if we have it, I add a little mustard. I saw mustard here, but now they took all my stuff away. Okay. <laughs> They're cleaning up too well here. Give it back. <laughs> my cleaning crew is amazing. So, we're gonna make sandwiches here. Where did they all put everything? What happened with Andrew? He's still taking everything away from me. What do we have? Okay, bring it over. And, and look at what we've already cooked up. Cin it's cinnamon raisin bread, blueberry yeah, look bread. At, look at all. We made a carrot cake in here too. Wow. Okay, thank you. All right, let's finish that and then we're gonna go through everything. So I have some pastrami here. Okay, so that could be ham, that could be anything you like. All right, let's use it all up, a perfect lunch. Put some tomatoes on top. Okay, and then we put cheese on top. Okay, and then we're gonna put it into our panini maker or put it in the oven and bake it. It depends what you have at home. Okay, you have the panini? Okay, so another good idea, if you wanna have the perfect panini, 
put a little mayo on the outside of the bread. It makes it crispier. It gets it a better color. So mm. on both sides, if you want to, or just on one side. So not a lot, just a little bit. All right, the panini is here. So you also, I still think we have a few. Okay, good. So we put that right in here. Okay, and we're gonna bake our sandwich. So if you wanna make a great sandwich with this bread, you are sure to have the best quality you ever had. All right, now, one of my favorite things always is, uh, I forgot to put mustard in it, but it's okay. What my favorite is, it's the pound cake. So for me, oh, look at the dough here. Look how beautiful the dough is here. See that? Mm -hmm. So this could be my pizza dough here. This could be a dough like we used it for our uh, bread here. What do you call it? The bread is bread. Jesus Christ, I forget the <laughs> English by now. Oh I'm talking too much. I think, can I talk in, in German? Maybe it's a top. We call it a top in German. <laughs> At least that's what they call it in Austria, where I come from. Oh, my God. Okay, let's put that back in there. Okay, okay, good. All right, now look at that. Here we have a beautiful lemon pound cake. Mm. So you can make it into a birthday cake. You can just serve it in slices. You can add more marmalade to it, squeeze it together. Yo, can you slice them a little bit? I, too much work for me. All right, we put a little bit of that on top. So I cut them into four equal slices. Okay, a little cream. Nobody gonna see you, just peel it up. Okay, and then put one more on top, one more marmalade. That pound All cake right, looks so, that's so it. creamy too. Yeah. And then if you wanna put something on top, we mm -hmm. can always just cut off the top a little bit, so that way you can put strawberries on top, raspberries on top. I'll just cut off the end, I mean. Okay. And then cover it with raspberries, strawberries, whatever you have, and you have a delicious little birthday cake. I mean, or restaurant just a quality. Cake. Re truly, yeah, if totally, you served totally. that in a, in a restaurant or walked into a bakery, what would you pay for that? I mean... Uh, for, yeah, that, like more than a flex pay for sure. Oh, for sure. A couple of flex payments. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I know, for sure. You know, at Spargo, one dessert is like 15 or $16, so you can figure it out yourself how much it is. I shouldn't say it because people might not come to the restaurant. <laughs> They're just going to bake at home from now on. <laughs> okay, a little... It's winter time, we put a little powder sugar on it, and that's it. So if it's a birthday, put a birthday candle right here, and you are done. You are done for the rest of the night. You have your cake, you have your uh, main course, you can eat your sandwich. How is our sandwich coming? Oh, perfect, yeah, coming a little more, yeah. All right, let's clean up a little bit. Oh, my God, look at that, I have no space here. <laughs> so. You get, the, you get the boxes, look at that. So you can make a birthday cake and actually then bring it to your friend's house wherever you go. Oh, perfect, how beautiful. Look at that. How beautiful, yeah. who wouldn't love that? I mean, come on, who would yeah. not love that? I know, so instead of going out and buying somebody a $50 birthday present, which is not much, or a bottle of wine, which will cost you even more maybe, you bring them a homemade cake. There is nothing better than that, you know? They know it's made with love. They know you made it yourself. This is not like you take it easy and go to a store. But you don't have to tell them that you had this amazing helper at home, that you had this amazing machine at home who did all the work for you. <laughs> so right. all you did was slice it and put a little cream or marmalade in there and buy a few <laughs> strawberries or if you have other fruits, 
put them on top or put nothing on top, just a little bit of powdered sugar. And so simple, so easy. So simple, all right? so easy, but the perfection with which you're able to do it. Yeah. Everything, all you do, just decide what you want to do. 14 presets. So the hardest part is deciding, do I want to do the yogurt today or the jam? Do I want to do a bagel today? Do I want to, what do you want to do? It's all right here, simple, easy. If you can pick up the cook cookbook, this is great inspiration. It will make it even simpler. So it turns out absolutely perfectly. But for for $20 on your credit card, do it yourself. Make the memories, break bread that you have made bread. This is the time to do it and get it home and just experience it. Cause you know, chef, there's just nothing like it. Yeah. It is the memory of the smell. It is the flavor. It's knowing what you're putting in your body. It's all of those. You, you know, Alison, you're so right. Because I remember as a kid at home, when Sunday morning we woke up and my mother used to, or my grandmother used to make our, our, our bread, actually just like a whole wheat bread with raisins, cinnamon, and some nuts because we had a, a, a walnut tree at home. And so we always saved the nuts and then she chopped them up and mixed them with the sugar and cinnamon and put them in the loaf of bread. And just the smell of it on Sunday was amazing. We served the hot chocolate with it, and it was just the perfect breakfast for me. We did not need anything else, and all my sisters, everybody thought this is like the best thing. We did not know. We grew up with almost no money. We had meat once a week, maybe on Sunday for lunch or on Sunday for dinner. But the rest, we always had good things going on. Why? Because my mother was a good cook. But... At that time, she had so much work in the kitchen. I know when she made bread, she was beating the dough by hand on her mm -hmm. board like crazy. And mm -hmm. then she had to put it in a mold and put a towel over it and let it rise somewhere. So that took time. And she couldn't go away because if it's too much proof and you put it in the oven, it falls down and then everything is ruined. You have to throw it out. So it's really a day's work. So I think this is really the best way where you can get quality, quality bread, like just like as good as you would have in any fancy restaurant. How is our panini? All right. Okay. All right. Let's bring it over here. Thank you. You want to take it out? <laughs> okay. Bring it in the machine. Okay. We have the panini maker too here. Look at that. Ooh, nice oh. and crispy. Yeah. Gorgeous. Can you hear it? Oh, yes, now, you can. <laughs> all you need is half a sandwich and the soup, and you have lunch. Look oh, at that. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. You get a close-up? Okay, look mm -hmm. at that. And with mm. that homemade If you want to squeeze out bread. the cheese. Oh, wow. Yeah, with the homemade bread, I mean, nothing is better. No. It just isn't. That's and you know, chef, when you think about it, if you walk into a bakery, I, I go to an Italian bakery. If you buy one loaf of yeah. bread, what you spend on that loaf of bread is crazy. And it's because, you know, they're in there doing it by hand. You know, this, totally. this is so and easy. If, if you make it with all ingredients, so that way the, the next day or two days later, the bread is not fresh anymore. So now the, you don't want to buy a bread which is two days old unless you buy something with all the preservatives in it, then it doesn't matter if it's a month old. But if it's really done the old fashioned way, the right way, you know, it's best eaten fresh. If you go to Paris, everybody in the morning runs out to get their baguette. Mm -hmm. They never buy a baguette for the next day. They buy it really fresh. So now with the custom setting, you can have fresh bread every day in the morning if you want to, or just for the weekend or just three times a week, and because the machine will do it for you. And you can pre-program this too, right? So you can yeah. set it so that you're waking up to the smell of, of fresh baked bread. I mean, unbelievable. It's an unbelievable opportunity. And, yeah. And you have the nut and fruit dispenser too. I forgot to show you that. Look at that here. And so you want to make a nut bread? Right. You put it in a dispenser here. You close it up and put it on top of the, the machine. You can see it here. I have it right here. Okay. Now I can put this one in here and that's it. So when I turn it on and make the dough, 
the, the, after 20 minutes, the nuts will fall right in there. And it's so easy. Let me show you it here. See? Look at that. Come on, close in here. So that's how it works. There's a button here which is going to be released. Oh, and this thing comes out. I, mean, I don't have a good aim, but it's okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mm. So you you can even put candy in there, right? You could do candy. You can make your fruit cakes with everything. That you can make your fruit cakes. Mm -hmm. You can make your chocolate chip cakes and everything. The most important part is you're gonna get bread when you want it. It's gonna be fresh when you want it, and that's all the difference. You know, it's not something you buy in the store where it stays the same forever, and you know. When you read the label, you said, what did they put this gum in here? Why is this in there? Bread, there should be four ingredients. You know, it's not so complicated, but it's the work which is complicated, which the work is really a lot. So now you can do it at home without working. You just throw the ingredients in here and that's it. And it, and it does everything. It even knows how, how long yeah. to let the dough rest. I love that. Everything about it is done for you. All you have to do is decide what kind of bread do I want or do I want yogurt? Do I want jam? Do I want jelly? What do I want? And it's going to do everything for you because all you do is push a button. Add the ingredients, push a button, yeah. let this do everything. A $20 bill on your credit card. You do not want to miss out on this. Never before have we brought you this with that special dispenser for your, your fruit, your nuts, your candies. Red, black, stainless steel, our best seller. If you want it in the black, I think we have something like 500 now. Okay, just about 600 left if you want it in the black. Stainless, turquoise, we have a mint green, and again, you're even getting your gift boxes for all of your breads, your, your pound cakes, your fruit cakes that you might want to give for the yeah. holidays. But this is the time. You make the memories. We, we get to spend, hopefully, some time with our huh? friends and families now. 152. <laughs> you know, it is so amazing, I think, when people come to our house, and if it's a winemaker, they will bring their own wine. If it's somebody else, they will bring something. But I think if you go now to somebody's house and you can bring them this cake, get a close up here. Where is the, my close up guy up there? He's, he's, uh, he's deserting me. Are you still up there, Cliff? All right. You bring a cake like that to somebody's home, people are gonna say, wow, where did you buy that? What bakery did you get it? but you know you made it at home. They probably won't even believe you if you say, I made it myself. They said, I never knew you were a baker, but now you have become a baker par excellence. You can make bread and cakes as good as any bakery out there. And that's what I want for you out there. I want for you that you use your hard earned money and have great results. You know, if you cook at home, if you bake at home, you wanna be sure you don't gonna mess it up. You wanna be sure that the result is always excellent, that everybody gonna come over and says, how did you make that? This is so amazing. You have such an amazing baker or cook. All of a sudden, you will get all these accolades and people are gonna say, my God, you know what? This lady or this man is really amazing in the kitchen. And you know what? Don't tell them it's the machine who made everything for you. You tell them, yes, thank you very much. And I let them put your back. So it's really a good way to start out the, or to finish the year. And you know, we all spend so much more time in the kitchen than we ever did before. Everybody is cooking Absolutely. at home. So now you get the perfect bread. You don't have to run to your supermarket to buy some cheap imitation bread. Make it the right way in your own home. Make it the right way, make it easy, make yeah. it the only way you can with Wolfgang Puck's innovative designs. Chef, thank you so much. Always such a pleasure to see you. This is a fabulous memory for everybody who gets this home because this will be unforgettable for your friends and your family, unforgettable. Yeah. And you know, only today. So right. I'm not here tomorrow or after tomorrow. If you want it for the holidays as a gift for yourself, get it now while we still have the colors. I hear black is already in sell out quantities. Yes, so go fast and order. So this is really an important part. Don't call me in the restaurant after and say, Wolfgang, <laughs> I forgot to order my bread maker. Don't you have any? That people <laughs> do that all the time. So do it now. And you know, it's the best price. And oh, five flex space. For 20 bucks, you get it in your home.
fabulous. Thank you so much, Chef, and our best to Marion, too. Tell her hi for us. Stay in the ordering process for this, and stay tuned, because Helen's up next. She's going to make you look good with some beauty. The thing I love about shopping at HSN for the holidays? Oh, that one's easy. Flex Pay. Flex Pay is like Santa's little helper. It allows me to get everything on my gift list and make monthly payments with no interest or fees. Even if you're on the naughty list. I got a gaming system for my nephew, a pair of funky boots for my sister, and a little something just for me. Flex Pay allows me to be the best gift giver I can be without the worries of paying for all of my holiday shopping at once. Beat that layaway. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item